Okay, we're talking to Emily Reed. How old are you now? 22. 22, and this was your second fight ever? My third. Your third? Yes. Okay, so you fought for the first time in October. Yes. And tell us how much training you did before that fight. None. They called me that morning and asked me if I wanted to fight. The morning of the fight? Yes, and I drove on up there. I fought. <laughs> Had you been doing any kind of... No. No. Why did no, they call you then? Well, my friend was going to fight. She's like, hey, you want to fight with me? I was like, well, if they got a girl, sure, I'll fight. And she's like, all right. And they called me the next day. I'm like, hey, we found somebody. I was like, well, let's do it. That's pretty brave. <laughs> yeah. And, and you liked it, huh? Because you yes. won. Yes. Yeah. And then the second fight was the same thing. They called me that morning. Like, you want to fight tonight? Like, where's it at? They're like, Illinois. <sighs> Drove seven hours, got there, and fought. So this is becoming kind of a regular thing now. Yeah. 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 So you came out pretty scrappy tonight. You had some good. You had some good shots. You yeah. almost had a guillotine a few times. Right. So are you starting to work more on your ground game and um, stuff? I or? need to. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. If I had a, a longer, you know, start. I sure. Guess, you know. Yeah, a lot of potential there because you're very scrappy, very scrappy and very tough. <laughs> so, okay. I, whenever I tell people that I'm going to an MMA fight, the reaction is always, oh, you know, how, how can you watch people get beat up and how can they get beat up and how can they hit other people? So. Tell me what you love about it. I think it's fun. That's all there is to it to me. I mean, it's a great stress relief. Yeah. <laughs> so that's, I just love it. What do you do? What's your day job? Are you in school or are you school, working? I'm college. You're in college? Nurse. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Save people and hurt people. Yeah, all right, exactly. all right. And so now, um, you were laughing with Laura a little bit ago because you guys were actually talking to each other during the fight. Tell me about that. Um, I was just telling her, hey, you're doing good. She's like, well, you are too. Yeah. In the middle of the fight? Yeah. yeah. That's amazing. <laughs> Do you, is she the only person you've done that with? Because I haven't um, seen no, that before. I've talked to all the girls I fight with. I'm like, you're doing good. And if they're doing something, I don't think they should be like, oh, no, no, no. And then if they go ahead and do it, then I'll... You know, grab their arm or something like that. Why? <laughs> do most of them talk back or do they? Um, a couple of them laughed at me. Yeah. Whenever I was telling them they did a good job, just staring at me like, oh, you know, gotta keep it entertaining. <laughs> That's funny. That's fun. So, did you grow up playing other sports? Uh, basketball. I still love soccer. Sports is my thing. Cool. Yeah, so you're just having a good time taking it day by day, huh? Yeah. Great. Well, good job tonight. Thank